Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a train. I'm going to take one finger on the bottom over here on the left and I'm going to put a dot and from that dot I'm going to draw a straight line all the way across to the right. Coming back to the left I'm going to draw little straight lines like a rectangle. Little straight line down, straight line across, straight line up, connect little straight line down, straight line across, little straight line up, connect. Little straight line down, straight line over, straight line up, connect. Little straight line, straight line, straight line up. Little straight line, straight line up. Now everybody's going to have a different amount because we all draw differently. But basically, it's a little straight line, straight line across, up, connect. Now, I come back over here to the left, and right about here, I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a circle. And in front of that dot, uh, circle, I'm going to draw one, two little circles. I come over here on the left and I draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect, come back to the left and draw a straight line across, connect. Come over here on the upper part of the right and we're going to draw a straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, connect. And on top of that, I'm going to draw a little skinny rectangle. Straight line out, straight line up, straight line over, straight line down, straight line over, connect. Inside this space, I'm going to draw a little square. Straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. I come back over here to the left-hand side and I draw one, two, three straight lines. I come back over and I draw a straight diagonal line out on the left, straight line across, straight diagonal in, connect. If you have room, draw a little curved line on the left hand side, jump over, draw one, two little curved lines on the right. Come all the way down here on the bottom and draw a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal connect. We're going to draw one, two little straight lines inside. Come inside your circles and put one dot, put another dot, put another dot, and watch what I do. I draw a straight line across, straight diagonal up, connect. Come inside and draw one, two little curved lines. Okay. Now come right here where this connects and draw a straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, connect. And right about even here we're going to draw a straight line down, straight line over, straight line up, straight line connect. And underneath we're going to put one, two baby circles, put a dot and a dot. Come back down here and draw a straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. We're going to draw another box. Straight line down, straight line over, straight line down, straight line, connect. Underneath, we're going to draw one baby circle, draw another baby circle, put a dot inside, put a dot inside, and if you have room for one more, straight line, straight line, straight line, connect, come up, straight line down, straight line over, straight line up, straight line over, connect, underneath, one baby circle, another baby circle, put a dot, and put a dot. 
Now we want these cars to look like they've got something in them. So at the top part, I just go wavy, wavy, line up, down, connect. Come to the next one, wavy line up, down, connect. Come to the last one, wavy line up, down, up, down, connect. Come all the way back over here to the left, and we're going to draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And next to that, we draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And one more curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And one more if you have room, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Okay, let's see. I'm pretty sure that's everything and we are ready to color. Okay. Okay, I went through my crayons and I decided to use all the colors. So this section of my engine, I'm going to do red. And I'm going to do this last cart, car, red also. Then I came in and I did my middle car, orange. And then I did my very first car, yellow. Okay? I came back in with a green. And I did the top part of my engine, green. And this section here. And I did all of the stuff that's inside my cars. I did this green. I don't know what it is, but I did it green anyways. Okay? Alright. Then, I took my blue and I did this section of my train engine. I did this bottom cow catcher part. I did this blue. I did my wheels blue all the way. I did my little box window here blue. I did my attachments in between my carts, cars blue. And I did my wheels blue. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. All the way across. Then I took my brown and I did my tracks these little baby rectangles. I did these brown. I took my black and lightly colored the bottom part. Maybe this is asphalt for my track. All the way across on the bottom. Not so dark, it hurts your hand. Then I took blue-green. And I drew blue-green stripes all the way down and across my picture you got to remember don't draw through your train don't draw through your clouds keep going all the way across and you got to do the little parts in between all the way down and across go all the way to the top Okay, I think that's all. Let's see what it looks like all colored in. Okay, here's my train all colored in. This would be great for using for transportation or also for the story, the little engine that could. I think I can. I think I can. Okay, bye-bye.